So hi guys, I'm Antonius and in this video lesson I will show you how to put those numbers, the, num the scores we have in the two text view, uh, edit uh, texts. This one is for the first team and uh, this one is for the second team. When we click to go button we want these two numbers go team 1 and team 2 as you see here, not the uh, zeros. So that's what we're gonna do. Go to starting tips XML or XML files. As you see here, is the first edit text who contains the number. The name of the first edit text is it is score one. The name of the second edit text it is score two. And we have a button a big go. If we go to the activity, the starting tips Java, you can see here that we have a already from the previous lesson set the OK button, the Go button, sorry, with some click listener and uh, and implements. The OK, the Go button is here. OK. When we click the Go button, we have a new row in our table. Now we want to set two new variables. Let's zoom it first. For edit text, as you see here, edit text et team 1 and edit text et team 2 team 1, I just uh, put the variables here we have to come in and uh, set the et team 1 control space and this will be equal to the edit text find view by id r dot id dot uh, we need the the edit text one or the it is score one let's put the it is score one first close here I think that we didn't have the the right ID in the second edit text here is our edit text it is score one it is score two we have an save it yet that's why I can see the second edit text the first edit text it's ok you can copy this control C paste it below change the edit team to and it is score 2 I think that we are okay and now we need to to get the text from those two edit text but when we click the button it team 1 get get text and we have to put it somewhere where when we get we, we need a string variable let's name it score this will be equal so in a string score it be equal to to it item get text to string okay we will do the same for the second let's name this one score one and this one score two get the text for the from the second edit text and now uh, in here which is the text view for the first column of uh, the row in the table we want to use the score one variable and here we want to use the score two variable save it and run to see the result select emulator here is the results if we click go I have nothing here zero if we click and have a number here click go as you see here we have the result that we want but the problem is when it's empty if it's empty 
if it's empty and click go we have an empty line here if we have a number it works it works fine we need to to fix that uh, problem and if the number is uh, zero of or is empty all the text in the edit text is empty do nothing so let's fix that so to fix this we need uh, an if statement and we will uh, check if the score one variable it uh, contains uh, let's zoom it to see it better the score one contains equals to uh, to null string if it's true we want to score one equal to uh, zero and we want the same for the second score for the second score here so the score one takes the, the text for the it team one the score two take the text for the it team two if the it team one or it team two contains null string it will appear for us in the row of our table uh, zero same in the second score else it will appear the text that contains the AT team the AT team one and the AT team two control S to save zoom out and run to see the results so here is the results if we click go we have uh, the empty edit text with a zero number if we click and put a number inside click go we have the number here if we click put a second number here and click ok we have a new row with uh, the two numbers so maybe if we click go we want uh, the edit text to clean from the previous uh, number so let's do that here control and uh, every time that we put a line which here we want the two text views the text views variables is the tt1 it team 2 so it team 1 we will set the text to 0 and we will do the same with, for the second one so let's run it save it so let's try it now click go we have two numbers here okay write number here click go we have the number here and uh, the edit text is clear if we put two numbers one from the first team one for the second team click go that's i think we are okay so that's it for this lesson uh, guys thank you for watching and i hope i see you again have a nice day night